What's up YouTube, Surrogate here, and today I'm going to be reviewing The Wimpy Begin Movie Diary. And by the way, last time I reviewed Diary of Kid The Last Straw. So today, there's no spoilers about the movies. So on the front it has Greg touching the cheese for this scene. The cheese touch. And so it says... How Greg Heffley went to Hollywood, it says Jeff Kinney, and it has the story of all three movies. Here's the spine, it has the real actor Greg, Zachary Gordon, and here's the back. It has three scenes from each movie, and here are the movies. So, I'll show you some pages. Let's talk about the book. So in this book, it's not basically any story like in The Last Straw or The Ugly Truth. It's basically behind the scenes. Like here's a picture of Greg, the director. Here is, here's the picture of um, all the characters, cartoon characters. And here's uh, Zachary Gordon. It says, to Zach and Robert. Robert plays Ralph and says, diary. Ah. It says, a wimp is born. So it's basically talking about when Greg Healthy was created. He was created in 1998. And here is when Greg, I mean, Jeff Kinney drew Greg and all those pictures for every single book. Like, this is the picture of Last Straw when the teenagers dry it by and the trash can falls over. Here's a picture when, I don't remember, oh yeah, it's from the, from the first one where Greg tells on Manny when he draws a picture of some kind of monster on his door with a pen. Here's a picture of a loaded diaper, but Jeff Kinney wrote diaper whip. Here's the cheese touch on the playground. And here's Dad vacuums Saturday at 8 a.m. And Roger can't sleep. So here's Jeff Kinney's sketch pad. So when he started writing down kid ideas, it looked like this. And then he got to this. And then Here's Zachary Gordon at age five. That's his fifth birthday. Here's Zachary, the first novel ever made. And so it just talks about behind the scenes, deleted scenes, interviews, and here is the movie opens with a with a crane shot of a middle school playground. A cold wind blows across the basketball court scattering leaves the camera comes to the rest of the moldy piece of cheese so they're planning on how the cheese touch will look <clears throat> so it it is uh, greg's lines for the movie zachary gordon's lines here's roderick's lines i mean i forgot the actor's name here is the director I forgot his name. Man, I keep forgetting names. So don't trust me. Okay, here is a page. I've read this book, but not so much. Here is the preview of the movie. Here's uh, the two actors that played Manny. There are actually two actors. Because if one couldn't do the scene, the other one would step in. So another page actually this actress was in the movie the inventions of hugo cabaret here's the mode keys this this page is called a cheesy villain and so step one you have to make the cheese white then paint it then um, paint it more and then it looks gross. Okay, 
Here's the master plan. I don't know what this one's about, but when you have to plan out every single thing from the movie, you have to hire an artist to draw. But the director had, he didn't want any artists for him to draw. So he drew his own. Here's clothes. Here's Manny's clothes. And then here's Ralph's clothes. So, in conclusion, I don't want to get into any behind the scenes spoilers. So, read the book. Find out. So, that was the review of the One Beacon Movie Diary. And like I trusted you, no spoiler alerts. So, bye bye bye. And... Thumbs up. And can I please give 4,000 likes? Mm -hmm.